Today in this video we're looking at how to extend or duplicate the display on your PC. So when you've got a dual monitor set up, so basically you've plugged your monitors in, you've turned them on and you go to use them. What quite often can happen is that actually the default setting is a duplicated display setup. This isn't ideal at all by any means, especially if you've got two screens. So whether you're working on a project, whether you may be looking at a presentation or working on very specific but maybe very different tasks, knowing how to actually manage your display can be really, really useful. Particularly as having also an extended display enables you to be much more productive as well. So I'm now going to show you step by step how to actually extend or duplicate the displays on your PC. So as you can see on our PC at the moment, we have a duplicated monitor setup. So in effect, the displays are showing exactly the same information. Now, if you've got two monitors, this is quite unusual to have a dis duplicated display setup maybe. there are It does have its place, maybe you're doing a presentation or something and you want to see what's on the other screen. So it hasn't got its place, but let's show you how now to actually make the changes to the display settings so you can make those changes with ease. So if you go down to the left magnifying glass, left-hand side of the screen, left click on your mouse and type in the box display, select duplicate or extend to a connected display. Now if you scroll up, you can see at the moment we have one box on screen, which is the one monitor showing a duplicated setup. The monitor numbers are in there, okay? And you, if you click on identify, you can see that the, exactly the same information on both screens, which denotes a duplicated setup. Now if you want to go ahead and make your monitor show different things, i.e. have an extended setup, if you scroll down and select under multiple displays on the drop down, you can choose to extend these displays. So click on that. And if you're happy with the changes, you can also see the screens change as well. And also if you scroll up, you can now see you've got different, we've got two monitor boxes, which is a confirmation of a extended display setup. And you can identify which monitor is which. You can see on screen by clicking the identify number. And if we reduce that down, you can also see now that we can move between the two screens and you can also move apps, etc., between the screens. So you've got your two monitors actually set up now to show different things, but you may be facing another problem in that you might not be able to move your mouse or apps, for example, across the two screens effectively. It feels like you can't move across the screens, but this is quite a common problem with the dual monitor setup and you just need to make a few changes. I have created a specific video on this, which will enable you then to move your mouse and apps between the two screens easily. You can click on the links appearing on screen now. But many thanks for watching our video today on how to extend or duplicate the displays on your PC. We'll see you on the next video.